first alert weather with Cassie Campbell is sponsored by St. Francis Healthcare System. It was a bit of a chilly start to our day, but we're going to start to feel that sunshine and warmer temperatures through the afternoon. We do have this weak cold front that's going to work through today into tomorrow, which is going to shift those winds out of the south back to the north northeast but you're really not going to feel much of an impact from it. We are going to see those mostly clear skies through the remainder of our day today on our satellite and radar can still see the clear dry skies, but just off to our west can see the clouds just slowly starting to roll in overnight tonight into Wednesday morning. Could see a little bit of cloud coverage, some high clouds, but they'll clear out later in the day. Let's go ahead and jump to future cast around 430 this afternoon can still see mostly clear skies. That sun is going to be out and about for our Tuesday afternoon. Rolling into tonight, we do start to see a little bit of those patchy clouds and then they'll slowly start to move in overnight into Wednesday morning. Now kicking off the day on Wednesday, head to school or work. We will be under a lot of that cloud coverage, but by the time we get to the afternoon, the sun's then going to start to come back out and it's going to be pretty nice for Wednesday. Slightly bit cooler in the lower 50s for Wednesday afternoon but at least staying dry. Wednesday evening, having those clear skies back into the heartland, start to see those below freezing temperatures roll back in for Thursday morning, depending on where you're at. And then by Thursday afternoon, looking like another nice day across the heartland. A few light clouds Thursday evening into Friday, but outside of that, just looking at beautiful blue skies for most of the remainder of our work week. Right now, looking outside at Perryville, can see those blue skies and those winds a little bit breezy again, starting to come out of the north northeast, but Still won't be too bad over the next couple of days. Highs today are going to be in the mid 50s for us, slightly above average for this time of year. 56 in Paducah, 55 in Marion, 55 here in Cape, 56 down in Union City. By the time we wake up tomorrow morning again, it's going to be chilly. Your evenings and your mornings are still pretty cold, so you're going to want to bundle up, headed outside the door, maybe add a little extra time to even start that car in the morning. 32 in Murray, 29 in Mount Vernon, 31 in Fredericktown with some of those cloudy skies for us Wednesday. Throughout Wednesday afternoon, the sun will come out a little bit, 52 tomorrow, 53 on Thursday, gradually seeing those temperatures increase as we head into the end of the work week, partly cloudy on Friday. And then as we head into the weekend, the clouds roll in just a little bit. We are tracking the chance for a little bit of rain. Timing is still uncertain as the system is well off from our area, but as it gets closer, we'll try and pinpoint the timing for us. There could possibly see a little bit of rain into early parts of Sunday, but outside of that, it's looking like a really nice several days in store for us. We're going to stay in those mid 50s through the next couple of days. Your evenings staying in those 30s.